there. Have you heard of sari weaving? Sari is a Japanese freestyle form of weaving that is fun, creative, and best of all, incredibly easy to do. Hi, my name's Prue Simmons, and I'm from Dying to Weave Studio, and I'm one of only three people accredited here in Australia to teach this beautiful style of Japanese weaving. So, what is sari weaving? Well, it's a freestyle form of weaving allowing the weaver to just enjoy creativity, to create a really beautiful, unique piece of cloth. In fact, that's what sari means. It comes from two Japanese words. Sai, meaning originality or uniqueness, it's from the Zen vocabulary, and ori, meaning weaving. And that is exactly what you are creating at this beautiful loom, a unique, one-of-a-kind piece of cloth. And that's what sets sari apart from your more traditional forms of weaving. And the fact that it is not pattern-based. Traditionally with weaving, weaving can be very pattern-based, very precise, very mathematical. You can't make a mistake. You have to make sure you're following the pattern because if you make a mistake, it will be really obvious. Sari is the complete opposite of that. In fact, the overarching philosophy of sari weaving is that there's no such thing as a mistake. You cannot stuff this up. And that's what sets it apart. It means that the weaver is then allowed to just experiment the loom, to just create with colour and texture and yarn. To not worry if they're doing it right or wrong. Have they made a mistake? Is that the right colour? Is that the right thing to do? You don't have to worry about any of that because anything goes in sari weaving. And it allows your creativity to be a lot more freeing. Now, combined with that, the really easy movement of the loom, and it ends up being meditation in motion. So this is all there is to it when you're weaving at a sari loom. Now I'm incorporating all parts of my body to do this really, really beautifully and gently. And that's the thing about these looms. They are incredibly ergonomic. They're a little bit like a hybrid between a floor loom and a table loom but incredibly comfortable and easy to use. So they're handcrafted in Japan by just a couple of people at the Sari organization, and they are designed to make sure that you have the most fun and the easiest and most enjoyable form of weaving possible. So when I'm sitting at the loom, I'm using my shuttle with my hands in a really easy flowing kind of way. And then down the bottom, I've actually got my feet on a couple of pedals, and that's how I'm switching over my shed. So together, it creates this real beautiful all-body experience in a really, really gentle way to be able to create at the loom. You're not reaching, you're not overstretching, you're not overly taxing parts of your body. And so this is all there is to it, to start weaving. Just this very simple, rhythmic, gentle motion. And because of that, it becomes meditation in motion. Now, when you start to get to that point where you can switch off thinking, you can just go with the flow, it actually takes your weaving out of here and into here. Because that's the other benefit of not having to conform to a pattern and follow a pattern, is that it switches your brain off a little bit and allows you to tap into what the Japanese call your kansei, your inner creative spirit. For freestyle weaving, that is the ultimate goal, to be able to just let go and freely create at the loom, to have that beautiful form of meditation and then at the very end, a tangible form of that meditation in your cloth. So these looms, that's what sets these looms apart. That's what sets the sari weaving apart, is that you have that beautiful flexibility of being able to use whatever you like in your weave and to weave very freely in your creativity as well. And you can use anything you like in your weave. It doesn't have to be a particular type of yarn. It doesn't have to be a particular twist or a certain um, weight. It can be absolutely anything. And you can mix different yarns together in the one piece. Use wool or cotton or silk or cashmere all in the one piece and see what happens. It looks absolutely gorgeous. You can also, it's a great, it's a very sustainable form of weaving because it means that you can use yarns that may not necessarily be used in other projects. Remember these yarns? These eyelash yarns and these really, really kind of bobbly textured yarns? Now, they are horrendous to knit with. We all know that. But they've been given a new lease on life in a sari weave. 
And all you need to do to incorporate them into your weave is to get a bit of a clump together and literally pop it straight into your piece. Then just follow through with your shuttle. And now I have this absolutely gorgeous little pop of colour and texture happening in my weave. And best of all, I'm using a yarn that may not necessarily have been used for something else. It could have even have gone in the bin. So it's a great way to use up everything that you have. It's a really good stash buster. It's a great way to use up all those bits and pieces, yarns that you may not use in other projects, yarns you don't have enough of for other projects. They can all go straight into the sari weave. If you're a spinner, oh my goodness, the sari weave is your best friend. This uh, is such a great way to actually show off your beautiful hand spun yarn. You know, sometimes you've created such beautiful subtlety in how you've spun it and how you've plied it, it kind of gets a bit lost sometimes when you're knitting it together or crocheting it together. But in a sari weave, it is all on display. And what a great way to use your really chunky spinning, your art yarns, your core spun, your, your beehives, put them all in a sari weave. They look absolutely magical. They're best friends. So it's a really great way to be able to combine your other forms of creativity and create really, really amazing cloth from what you've done. Now the looms themselves are absolutely gorgeously and ingeniously made. They're handcrafted by just a couple of people over at the Sari organization and they are made to be to last. So they're, they're, they're fantastic. They just keep going and going and going. But they're, they're made to be very, very flexible in their design. They're also incredibly portable. So the loom that I'm on today, the WX60, it's, it's sort of like a little mini floor loom, which is fantastic. But the great thing about a floor loom or the, the difference to a, a standard floor loom is that this one actually folds up and you can pop it out of the way. And you can see one of the WX60s folded up just behind me here. So, and you can do that mid project. Stop wherever you are. If you decide you need to have a break, fold up your loom, pop it out of the way, and then you can bring it back out when you're ready to weave again. It also means it's super portable. Take it outside, weave under a tree, take it to a different room in the house, follow the sunshine around the house, take it to a friend's house and weave, take it on holidays. It's really, really easy to be able to travel with your sari loom as well. And if you want something even more portable, they even have a smaller, more lightweight aluminium version of their loom, which you might be able to see in the background over at the back of my studio there called the Piccolo. So it's all about weaving wherever you are and making weaving as enjoyable as possible. Now the other thing that often uh, people are a little bit intimidated about if they want to start weaving is setting up the loom, making the warps, getting it all prepared before you get to the fun and interesting creative part of actually weaving. Now Sari have solved all that for you because they want you to get to the fun part really quickly. So they actually make the warps for you and they put them on up to a 30 metre roll. So all you need to do is just slide that onto your loom, you thread it up once and it's a really straightforward process just using one hook, thread it up and then you have up to 30 metres of weaving to enjoy. Now at any point you can stop the, the bit that you're doing, you can say right that's enough for my scarf, that's enough for my jacket, that's enough for my jacket for my dog or my cushion and you can cut that piece off the loom take it off the loom and start a new piece. So you can just be pumping out different projects on your 30 metre warp without having to re-thread the loom. It is a game changer. Now these are done in black cotton and black wool, but if black doesn't float your boat or you'd like to be able to weave with a coloured warp, Sauri have you covered as well. Because they also make these absolutely gorgeous pre-wound warps in coloured threads as well. In cotton, silk, wool, cashmere, linen. So you could go through your whole sari weaving life without ever needing to make a warp if you don't want to. If you do make a warp, it's incredibly straightforward as well and I can teach you how to do that. So the pre-wound warps are absolutely fantastic and again, pop them on the loom, thread them up once and you're off and racing. The other great thing about these looms is the flexibility of being able to use different projects on the loom. 
So you can actually get uh, what's called the inside set, which is the inner workings of your loom, an additional set. And that means that you can interchange projects at any time. So if I'm working on my black warp, and now you know what, I wanna grab my pink warp and start working on that one. I can actually switch over a project at any stage, midway through a project, doesn't matter, and work on a different piece. So it means too that multiple people can use the loom as well. You could each have an inside set and you're basically just sharing the frame of the loom. So it's great if you want to share it with a friend or a family member or you just want to have that little bit of flexibility with your works in progress. So it's definitely about the flexibility of the loom, the portability of the loom and the ease of using these looms as well. They're absolutely game changing compared to a lot of the other looms that are out there on the market. But I want to make sure if you invest in a loom like this, that you are happy, inspired, and most of all, confident with having this loom at home. So every loom that I sell through the Dye and Tweave Studio comes with full training to make sure that you are completely adept at using the, this beautiful bit of machinery. Now, you can do that by coming to the studio and doing an in-person class with me. But if you can't get to the studio and at the moment, Getting around is incredibly difficult, but if geography or the pandemic um, stops us from getting together, I provide all of that training online through resources as well and through online um, classes. So you'll also get access to my beautiful um, online sari weaving program, which is a virtual sari studio and the most amazing community of other sari weavers around Australia. So that's so that I can continue to help support, mentor and guide you with your sari loom on your sari journey. So these are absolutely incredible looms. Um, they all come as a package. So when you buy them, you get everything to get you started. Um, the loom, the shuttle, the bobbins, the threading tools, you get a bobbin winder on the side, which is fantastic. Um, you get a warp to get you started as well. So everything and you're off and racing. And then of course, that fantastic support to make sure that you're happy and confident with having this loom at home. So they are incredible looms. If you are new to weaving or you're, if you've always been interested in getting into weaving, a sari loom is for you. If you are a hand spinner and you want a way to actually take your, your spinning creativity to the next level, sari weaving is for you. If you want to create your own beautiful sustainable cloth and make your own gorgeous um, unique textiles, sari weaving is for you. If you're already a weaver and you just want a loom that is super simple to set up to use and is really, really comfortable, then sari weaving is for you. In fact, sari is for absolutely anyone because anyone can learn how to do sari weaving. It's something you can enjoy across the generations of your family as well. So if you're keen on finding out more about the sari looms and sari weaving, head to my website, dyingtoweave.com.au and that's dying with an E, D-Y-E-I-N-G. And, uh, and have a look at what's on offer um, in the Sari Looms. And I hope that we get to see you in the studio really, really soon. <laughs>